right from the beginning, we hit it off. The relationship is a very good one. We talked North Korea, covered that yesterday, a little bit today. Uh, we're talking military, and of course, we're talking trade. What we're going to be doing now mostly is trade. As the Prime Minister knows, they've done very well with the United States. We have a very big deficit, and we're going to weed that down, and hopefully get a balance at some point in the not-too-distant future. But uh, we have a massive deficit with Japan. Uh, we will, I believe, at the end of a fairly short period of time, be able to do certain things. I know they're ordering uh, large numbers of airplanes, both jet fighters and passenger planes, and it's, it's in the tens of billions of dollars. And they'll not only get the best plane, but will help with the process of equalization. Uh, so I think we're going to have a very, this is a very exciting meeting for me, because I like this maybe the best. Uh, I love the world of finance and the world of economics, and probably it's where I do the best. So, but we will be able to work things out. I'm very happy to have Larry Kudlow with us. Uh, he's a special man. He's been a friend. I've been on his show many, many times over the years. And we've had a lot of fun together. We haven't always agreed, but I noticed lately Larry's agreeing more and more with me, which makes me quite happy. <laughs> and uh, John Bolton, uh, John was really uh, very much involved yesterday with our meetings on North Korea and our meetings on the military. And John, it's great to have you and Larry with us. Real honor. Thank you very much. Uh, Mr. Prime Minister, thank you so much for being here and your representatives. Uh, the relationship has been so good with all of us. and. Let's see how we do with, right now, the trade deficit. Thank you very much for being here. Please. Once again, President Trump meeting with Prime Minister of Japan Shinzo Abe there in Palm Beach at Mar-a-Lago, owned by President Trump. President Trump bringing up the trade deficit, as he uh, always does, according to the U.S. trade uh, website from the government. $68.9 billion with Japan in 2016 when it comes to the goods trade deficit, but of course always debatable as to whether or not that's that actually a number that we should focus yeah. on. No, Shinzo we... Abe uh, obviously saying how much he likes Larry Kudlow also. Uh, that was a big part of his, <laughs> his remarks there and how he actually, Larry agrees with him too. So, but uh, actually the, the discussion there was about uh, aircraft trade in part uh, and that uh, selling uh, advanced uh, military aircraft to Japan uh, would uh, not only be good for Japan, but good for America and help redress uh, the president's uh, obsession, let's call it, with trade deficits. And sitting next to him, the man who just went to North Korea, we discovered this morning, uh, Mike Pompeo, yeah. who's, if you can't decide between the CIA director and the State Department, you get both with this guy, right? Because he is set to I fill in for Tillerson. Hey there, thanks for checking out CNBC on YouTube. Be sure to subscribe to stay up to date on all of the day's biggest stories. You can also click on any of the videos around me to watch the latest from CNBC. Thanks for watching.